Hello. Today we're gonna talk about hello. hello, 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 hello. Today we're gonna talk about counts and motions. What are counts? Counts are numbers that you prepend to your motions to multiply their effect. So let's have an example. Imagine that I'm in this first line right here, and I want to find the first octurants of E, the letter E. That I can do with uh, the F motion, so F and E, and I get that right. If I want to go to the next occurrences of this uh, letter E, I can type uh, the semicolon, comma to go backwards. Now let's say that we want to find the second occurrence at once uh, of this letter E. We can use a count and prepend it to our motion to achieve that effect. So instead to find E, we type to find E, and you can see how Vim senses to the second occurrence of this letter. This can be very useful because it allows you to do things faster, in this case, move faster, and also because um, counts work with all the motions that you've learned this far. So for instance, uh, we can go down one line, or we can go down two lines, or we can go down five lines. One thing that you may have noticed is that my code line numbers are strange. Instead of remaining static, like you would expect uh, in a normal editor, the line number is relative to my current line, so where the cursor is placed. This is very useful if you want to use counts in combination with motions to navigate your file. So for instance, let's say that I'm on top of the file and I want to go to uh, the definition of that interface, ship, I can do 16 down and I'm in the line. So that's an alternative to just using something like search or other motions, you can use these relative numbers in combination with counts to be able to get quickly up and down within a file. Uh, how do you enable these relative numbers? Uh, you go to configurations here, go to settings, and then uh, open user settings. Now we search for line numbers. And you can see here how it says uh, editor line numbers. And there's different types. The one that I have selected is relative. And that is the one that gives you line numbers that are relative to your current line. So let's summarize. So count multiply the effect of motions. And you do count motion and the motion gets multiplied count times and for instance we did uh, 2 fe find second next e or we did uh, for instance 2j that brings you down a couple of lines good uh...